Hi everybody, Mitchell here. Um, I hope you're all having a good day. Um, and if you're struggling, I hope that you find something today that makes it a little easier for you to get through. Um, my thoughts and my hearts are with you all. Today, I just wanted to sit down and, I don't know, talk about some thoughts. I don't really have a specific topic today. I just wanted to check in with everyone. Uh, I hope you've been enjoying the lyric videos that I've made. I really enjoy making those. And I tend to choose uh, songs that I don't usually see on YouTube anywhere. Um, I wanted to share a little bit, I guess, about um, some things I've been going through and my spirituality and how it helps me get through. Um, I've been dealing a lot with grief for the past while. Um, I've had to learn patience with myself because one day I think, oh, I'm okay and I'm doing decently, making progress. And then the next day, or the next moment even, I know that I'm not okay. Um, Thankfully, though, I haven't reverted back to any of the self-destructive habits of my past. I've just been using this time to reflect and try to strengthen myself. And the most important part is to me. Um, is to let yourself feel your emotions, don't stuff them. Um, if you let yourself feel them, it removes the power. And at least some of it. And it uh, removes the power and lightens a little bit of the load as it leaves your consciousness. Um, I kind of call that purging. What I do is I try to purge the pain after I process it. I let it go and try not to hold on to it. Um, But if it involves something like conflict with someone, I purge the bad feelings, the bad memories. But I always try to hang on to the love and the good things because love is the highest vibration there is. And love, if you let it inside your heart, even if it's scary, if you let it in, it will heal you eventually. I'm not talking about necessarily romantic love, but it can apply 
just love in general. Um, I've experienced some things in this life. And one is... Uh, I had an experience one time. I've seen... I am spiritually gifted. And I've seen... Angels, I've seen spirits, I've seen light beings, and I felt a love, a pure, genuine, overwhelming love from the universe and our creator that is almost stronger than anything. I've ever felt on this earth. Um, it's what keeps me going sometimes. Uh, I hope to find that here on this earth, and I think I have felt it on this earth. Um, it's just very unique. And not easy to find. But when you embrace who you are and your personal power, embrace all of it the darkness, the pain, everything. Because even though you purge it, it can still be. A part of who you are and we are all people who have experienced pain in one way or another and it's it changes us it molds us we're all a little broken the pain and the darkness and the brokenness are all things that make us the beautiful people that we are sometimes it can help bring us empathy um, and compassion It doesn't make us bad that we've experienced these things. The things are bad that have happened to us usually. Um, but most of us learn that we can overcome and get through it. Things don't always get better. I've never believed that. I've, I've never believed that at all. Uh, some things don't get better. But we do get through them. Because we persevere. Um, a lot of us are fearful or uncertain in the world the way it is now. But we will adapt and adjust and persevere and continue to be the strong people that we are continue to spread your light and your strength and your happiness and feel the love enjoy the time with your uh, families and loved ones if you can I hope that this message that I brought today has helped somebody. Uh, to me, it feels like a little bit of rambling, but uh, I hope that it's helped somebody. And if you have any questions about anything, please drop them in the comments. I will do my best to answer. I do read all of my comments, and I appreciate everybody 
who supports me, including the silent support. It means a lot to me. If you have any suggestions for any videos, please let me know. And I will catch you next time. And thank you so, so much for watching.